in here, right, with our dreams and our, our desires and our, you know, drive. Then we have this inner critic that takes up space. Everyone on the earth has it. It's struggle. Everyone, no one is immune, no matter how high, like, of a level of success they've achieved. We've all had to battle it. We just don't, oftentimes, we think, well, that's, that's edge. That's what's driving me. And I think that that inner critic is what is stopping, you know, what stops us all from staying in our lane. And then we start to, you know, the inner critics worried about what everyone else is doing. Yeah. And when you start to compare, I mean, the joy is sucked out comparison. It doesn't, it serves no one because at the end of the day, even in a race, you know, when you get up, when you're really refining things and you knowing your competitors race strategies, even still, it doesn't matter because the only person you can control is you. So I think noticing and then letting it go and dropping the rope and stop trying to figure it out, but just notice the chatter and center yourself and show up for you anyway, if that yeah. makes sense. I, I mean, it's, yeah, noticing it. I think separating that voice and saying like, oh, look, like that voice is wanting me to compare myself to everybody else again. Here you go. But I, I'm, I'm here to do me. Yeah. Here's the water. Here's my lane. Like, let's go. Or whatever it might be, whatever sport. This is my office. Thank you.